Hello Jaguars. We are back for video number four, I believe. We're on day four, so it should be. Um, hopefully everybody's doing good. Adjusting to um, this new, if you want to call it normal. I don't know if it seems normal to you, it doesn't seem normal to me, but that's okay. Because we're still getting learning done and we still get to talk to each other which is important to me um so uh how did i spend my day three i know how you spent your day three because we had our uh, dancing shoes on today we had a lot of good submissions today through um class dojo it's uh a couple videos emailed to me too it's awesome to see i love it um Unfortunately, I did not make it outside today because it rained pretty much all day. Not cool, bro, right? You guys have heard that before. Um, it was also my daughters. I have one daughter in fourth grade and one daughter in first grade. It was their first day of uh, e-learning, so imagine how you felt on day one. That was their day one today. Uh, I think this picture kind of sums up the way my uh, fourth grader felt about it. But we made it. We made it through day one with them, so um, I survived. Um, I wanted to share a video that got shared with me today. Um, this was uh, us, uh, Ariana in second grade, hitting the Just Dance floor pretty hard. Not only is she getting those moves down, but she's doing it in sandals, that skill. Okay, um, spirit day um, for today is um, a spring picture. So we're looking for maybe a picture of you outside, a video of you doing something outside. Because um, remember, regardless of what your um, assignment is for the day or what your activity is for the day, you can always do something else. It is Thursday. March 19th, day four. Uh, you know what I'm going to say. What le letter is today? Say it with me. It doesn't matter what letter it is. That's right. P-E every day. Um, what are we doing today? It's a good question. Um, we are sock wrestling. You guys remember sock wrestling? We did it a few weeks ago. Um, it went really well. Everybody had fun. Have a uh, video queued up here for you so that you can refresh uh, your memory on the rules and how to play. And so you can show your parents how to play and let them know how fun it is. You can hold your own little sock wrestling tournament in your own house and see who the champion is. Should be fun. Okay, we are um, back at uh, our menu here for our activities for every day. Uh, we're over here at sock wrestling. I know it says day three, but we started a day earlier than we thought we were going to, so it should say day four. Um, if only I could edit, because I can. I'll have to fix that. Anyways, um, sock wrestling here. And if you click this link right here, if mom or dad clicks it, it will queue up um, Mr. Bear's uh, Twitter page here. And this is a little video showing the basics for sock wrestling.
Um, here we have the rules that we normally follow when we play. Um, I'm guessing a lot of people don't have juggling scarves just laying around in their house. I'm the gym teacher and I don't have scarves laying around in my house, so you probably don't either. You could just use a sock or maybe one of Dad's ties. That might be something good. So, sock wrestling today. Looking forward to seeing what you come up with. Um, something that um about me that we uh we might not know. Probably not hard to figure out, but um, I'm a big fan of video games. Most of you probably are too, or some of you. Um, on this slide here, you can see I've just shown you what some of my favorite video games are, two of the ones I play the most, and um, there's a little clip here of uh, playing a video game with my daughter in um, first grade that at first I was like, the last thing I want to do is play Roblox with you, but it's actually pretty fun. Don't tell her I said that. But... Show me the Show me. Oh. Impressive minor. Josie. What? <laughs> what are you watching? It's a baby show. Oh, okay. Uh, wrapping up for today's video. Gonna still try to keep cranking them out every day. Um, wasn't sure how long how long I was gonna do it, but um, I have a little bit more fun with it every day, so I'm gonna keep them coming. Uh, just a reminder, here is uh, email and Twitter for mom and dad if they need to reach out about something or if you want to email me to ask me a question or just to see how things are going, that would be cool too. And... Um, if you are watching this and you're in second grade, I want to remind you about our Flipgrid here. I was pretty pumped. I got my first response from a Raylan in Miss Dolm's class today, so that was that was pretty cool. So here's our um, Flipgrid information. If you're not on there, um, you're missing out because we could be having uh, could be having a lot of fun on there. Um, once we get some responses going on there, maybe change up the topics that we uh, talk on there, talk about. Just um, another way for us to stay connected, which is important. Um, lastly, I have uh, a few shout-outs for today from uh, submissions that I got through Class Dojo today. Going to try to do a, a shout-out every day, depending on what comes in. Um, today we have the uh, the Rainy Boys, um, Ernesto from Miss McLaren's class, and, um, and Addison from Miss Gigliardo's class. So I think uh, I think that's about it for today. Um, stay safe. Keep uh, hitting the e-learning hard. Stay engaged. Take care of your family. And what else? You know what I'm going to add on the end, right? Remember, we learned in yesterday's video that even Batman does it. Wash those hands, right? For how long? That's right. 
20 seconds. You guys can count to 20, right? All right, guys. I will see you tomorrow.